Hi guys, welcome to my review of the Key to Time box sets. Um, this review would be split into two parts because there are six stories in this set, um, which is you know probably the biggest Doctor Who box set there is. I think. Um, well, it's certainly the hugest one. Uh, right, so let's take a look at the artwork. You've got a uh, zoom in. You've got. Tom Baker there is the fourth Doctor, Romana Mark One. We got the Key to Time Cube, um, some more cubes in the background. Also, you've got the uh, new. Hold on a second, new doc. Uh, the not new, the Doctor Who logo, BBC at the top, um, and he's got what it says in the uh, what the stories that are included. Which are the Rebels Operation, the Power Planet, the Stones of Blood, the Androids of Tara, the Power of Kroll, and the Armageddon Factor. And it's a six, di uh, seven disc set. Um, it's a PG rated, and so yes, that's what is in the set. Now, if we um, take a look at the side label there, you've got a uh, some of the stories there and it's the same on the other side on the bottom you've just got some information and on the top you've just got this plain you know, swirls so let's take a look at the first story in the set which is uh, the reboss operation um, let's take a look at the artwork uh, you've got one of the sort of medieval guys there We've got a segment of the key to time or a fragment or whatever We've got an archway and you've got Romana and Canine and it's the uh, Tom Baker years 1974 to 81 um, you've got the side label and yeah you've got uh, some pictures hold on a second from the story and so yeah, let's take a look at the blurb. Oh, sorry, I'm zooming in and out all the time there. Apologies for that if it gives you a headache. And it's by Robert Holmes. The Doctor is summoned by the mysterious and powerful White Guardian and is sent to and sent on a quest to find the six segments of the key to time, which once assembled will restore balance to the universe. Uh, joining the Doctor and Canine is a smart and sassy Romana. A Time Lord fresh from the Academy. Landing on the wintry planet of Repos to locate the first segment, the TARDIS crew quickly find themselves embroiled in a little local trouble with a pair of conmen and an unstable warland, a warlord. Um, they got special features which are commentary by Tom Baker and Mary Tam, A Matter of Time, a new documentary exploring Graham Williams, three year tenure. As the Doctor, as Doctor Who producer, and the Key to Time season as a whole, featuring Tom Baker, Mary Tam, Louise Jameson, Elal Ward, um, uh, John Leeson, and plus new series writer Gareth Roberts. The Rebus File um, cast and crew look back on the making of the story, including Nigel Paskett and Sophie. Uh, Paul Seed um, and Prentice Hancock. Uh, season 16 trailer, the original BBC One trailer for the 16th season of Doctor Who. Uh, continuities off air, uh, continuity links but from the story's original transmission, radio times, billings, uh, coming from trailer, physically, production information, subtitles, and digitally remastered picture and sound quality. Uh, inside, We've got a uh, the rib separation disc and you know the booklet. Overall, I would rate the reboss operation a seven out of ten. Right, next we have uh, <clears throat> the pirate planet, um, which is the second story of the key to time. Uh, let's take a look at the artwork. Um, you've got a picture of Tom Baker there. Uh, you've got the second segment of the key to time. 
you've got the pirate space pirate uh, and you've got some like colorful pipes going diagonally down and uh, you've got I think it's a, you can't quite make it out but I think it's something from one of the spaceships Don big years 1974 to 81 and let's just zoom out yeah you've got a little sticker there as well got the side label there a bit of reddish um, to entertain and here you've got uh, some pictures from the story there and you've got the storyline and it's by Douglas Adams who also wrote Hitchhiker's Guide to the Galaxy and Sharda. The Doctor and Romana arrive on the planet Zanak looking for the segment of the key to time or the uh, priceless gems are scattered on the streets and the night sky changes with the dawn of each new prosperous age that turns folk like in fear or live in fear for a fortress overlooking the city the terrifying pirate captain is control of the most destructive force in the galaxy we've got special features which are commentary by Tom Baker the doctor Mary Tom Romana and Anthony Reeves, script editor. Commentary by uh, Bruce Purchase, the pirate captain, and Pennant Roberts, director. Uh, pirate Fashion, a 30 minute documentary featuring an archive interview with writer Douglas Adams. Uh, plus cast and crew, including Mary Tam, John Leeson, Bruce Purchase, and Rosalind Lloyd. Um, film inserts, deleted scenes and outtakes, a collection of extra material from the story's production, weird science, the spoof 1970s school program looks at some of the scenes, the science seen in the key to time season, continuities off air, continu continuity links from the story's original BBC One transmission, Radio Times Billings, coming soon trailer and production subtitles and digitally remastered picture and sound quality. Now, uh, inside, I'll just zoom out for you. We got the disc uh, and the booklet. Overall, I would rate the Pirate Planet um, 7 out of 10. So, yeah, that's the Pirate Planet. Um, finally, of part 1 of this review, we have. Stones of Blood, which is the third story of the key to time. And just take a look at the artwork. Uh, there, we got a there we go. picture of Romana, um, the Doctor there on the right hand side, and you have a picture of the stones and a guy with a torch, and, and another guy there wearing a weird costume. And you've got sort of purplish background uh, with stars and you've got the uh, Tom Baker years 1974 to 81 and you've got a picture well the sticker Keats Time Story 2 um, also on the side label nothing really much glowing on the side label apart from just blackness and here you've got some pictures from the story and let's take a look at the blurb which is by David Fisher. The search for the third segment of the key to time leads the Doctor Romana and K9 to Balmscombe Moor on Earth in the late 20th century. Here they encounter Professor Amelia Rumford and Vivian Fay, who are surveying an ancient stone circle called the Nine Travellers. What is the link between an ancient uh, Celtic go goddess? an alien criminal and a transporter ship concealed in hyperspace and can the doctor escape the uh, judic sacrifice of blood to uncover the mystery of the moving stones they got special features um, commentary by Mary Tam, Romana and Daryl Blake director commentary by Tom Baker, the doctor, Mary Tam, Romana, Susan Erridge, Vivian Fay and David Fisher, writer uh, getting blood from the stones, casting crew look back on the making of the stones of blood, including Mary Tam, John Leeson, uh, 
Hammer Horror, um, a short featurette considering the influences of horror films on Doctor Who stories over the years. Stones Free, Mary Town visits the whole uh, role right stones to meet experts on the ancient stone circle. Deleted scenes, deleted footage from part two, the model world of Robert Sines, an ex excerpt from a 1979 program looking at the model work of the Stones of Blood. Blue Peter and National Wise, the two BBC magazine programmes celebrate Doctor Who's 50th, 15th anniversary. Continuities off their continuity links from the story's original BBC One transmission. Radio Times Billings, coming soon trailer and photo gallery and production subtitles. And digitally master picture and sound quality. Um, so yes, that's this story. Um, inside, you got the disc and the booklet. It's a very red or pink disc. Overall, I would rate the Stones of Blood a 8 out of 10, because it's quite a good story. So yes, guys, that was uh, part one of this review. Um, the stories there. Um, so yeah, I hope you enjoyed this review, and see me next time for part two. Yay. Right, I shall see you then. Bye for now.